music for Lagos. 102.3 Max FM. Well, on the Max Breakfast this morning, we have um, an interesting topic. Uh, interesting because it's something that affects us in different ways. And courtesy of the situation that happened between the two big comedians here in Nigeria, yeah. AY versus uh, Basket Mouth. Mouth, of course, yeah. people were choosing sides on who to blame, who to you know defend in the course of that uh, beef, semi yeah. beef that uh, you know came up between the two. Well, both of them have come out with, with different angles to the story. One said, "Look, this is what happened. You didn't pay me my money when it was supposed to," and the other person said, "Look." that situation 90% of the the, the story that you gave us were lies and also to make matters worse he says look we're never friends Hmm. and people started asking wow wow this friendship thing is a a big deal because your friend that you are claiming as your friend might not be your friend at the end of the day true and it's friendship by force and also one question I want to ask is no matter the number of people that you claim as your friends yeah amongst those people you find people that do not have the best intentions for you yeah so how do you know whether your friend is your true friend so these are some of the things i'll be covering on this morning's conversation coming from that particular situation between ay and basket mouth all right if you're just joining us welcome once again to the max breakfast we'll be right back all right we're keeping it real with everything we're talking about and uh congratulations to uh, the max million winner not too long ago and uh we are still on that topic uh what is that definition of friendship actually i mean what does it mean to be uh someone's friend Going by the saga that's been, uh, you know, the rift that's been on between AY and Basket Mouth, it has raised a lot of questions. And uh, as, as Debbie did say the other time, sometimes you could be friends with someone and that person is not friends with you. Mm-hmm. You could think, oh, this is my friend, mm-hmm. but... Your friend, your friend. Your friend, your friend, but the guy is not your friend. You know, say, me, I don't learn lesson. Mm-hmm. That it don't happen to me tire before. Mm-hmm. Now, I meet the select friend. Mm-hmm. Friend, no, they select me again. Mm-hmm. Okay. I want me and you be friends. You don't reach level where you say you go to think, say... You, you, now you be the senior friend. Mm. And as a friendship, we get senior, we get junior. If you don't they, it's assume the position of senior friend, make me come be your junior friend, younger friend. Whether, you know, age, friend does not uh, consider age. But if you don't they consider yourself as superior in that friendship, I don't cut off. Mm. I don't move. Well, my own is, how do you know whether the person has cut you off? You know, say you won't cut person off. Yeah. But you like, in this case, you like the person. You want the person to be your friend. So you still do your friend, friend, friend thing. But that other person don't want you. But how you want, how you will take no say this person? <laughs> not be all the time. Go say, you go need to call on phone and say, that friend, where will be? Mm-hmm. And all me could be friend again. Mm-hmm. If me, me and Mark mm-hmm. would always meet in a joint, a junction mm-hmm. or a joint, mm-hmm. Mark will call me and I will come. We will mm-hmm. stay. By the time he call me again, I tell him, say, I'm not sure what I go make him. He call first, I call second time, I call third time. I the phone busy, busy, busy. He gonna say, mm. this guy not interested. Don't Something don't solve. True. Mm. Yeah. True. Okay. So when yourself. somebody starts for me busy for you, mm. for me busy, I'm for me that uh, this is where you talk. It's the so only I want to ask this question. I know I've, I've mentioned it before, but <laughs> coincidentally there was a heated argument. Right. Uh, you know, yesterday with me and some other people, I was like, if you're this person is your friend, friend. Mm. I said, forget the thing that people are saying friends. This person is your friend. You yeah. talk, you yeah. open up. Yeah. Then, before maybe, um, let's say this night, right? You yeah. still had a conversation. You still talk. Ah, you know, this happening to me, that happening. And then next morning, mm. you wake up to check the status of the person. And you see the person on that snow. <laughs> hey, so <laughs> this is how you snow is in Canada uh. or in wherever. Mm. How would you feel? I'll feel bad. I'll feel bad because at the end of the day, uh, you are such a friend that even if an opportunity comes your way, you would never let me know about it. So the argument that somebody gave to me was, what if they had told the person not to disclose it to anybody? See, there's look. Okay, by the time you don't turn anybody, that means... (laughs) Exactly. exactly. If you don't turn anybody, you don't be friends again. And there are some people that will tell you, I'm working on something, I will let you know soon. Mm -hmm. I'm working on something. By the time they move, fear... Mm -hmm. They just, hey, you know, say that's why they tell I'm working on something. Mm-hmm. Now, they work on be this. Exactly. You know, they, they best don't they def- in defense. No, I can still take that one. So, I was arguing that I don't think I can handle you telling, I mean, not telling me mm. at all. And I find out myself mm. that you've left or that you've, some, your status has changed. I'm not even, let's not even use that as the only example. Maybe you got married mm. and I didn't know. And you said, oh, it's because Pastor told you not to tell anybody. I uh, know. I said, yeah, it's fine. 
But you have now told me that I'm no long. I'm not in that position of you trust. You are the witch and wizard. The, yeah, that's what you have indirectly communicated. Yes. Debbie, let me tell you something. And the person was like, "No, I'm being very selfish." But I said, "No, no. I have to consider myself too. True. My own feelings yeah. about this." Okay, so Debbie, if you are my friend, mm-hmm. two things I will not ask of you from you. Mm-hmm. One, I will not ask you for money for mm-hmm. any reason, mm-hmm. even if the thing hold me for neck. Mm-hmm. I know if you ask, say, "Okay, give me," mm-hmm. because by the time I say, "Give me." Next time, if you see me, you're going to look at me like, ah, let me do you a favor last time. It no de- matter how no, friendly we no, are. It depends on the kind of friend. That's what I tell you about myself. Mm. Okay. okay. That is one. Okay, yeah. number that's, two. That's one thing I will not tell you. Number two, I will never tell you my family secrets. No matter how close we are mm. with anybody. So there are certain things that you There are you certain things that know if you can come out. Yes. Okay. Lying. All and right. they inside me. We're going to go to the phone lines very soon and now also find finish. out how you define friendship. What's yeah. your own definition of friendship? What are those things that you can't take? And how do you know if your friend... He's, He's no longer friend. friending you. <laughs> He's no longer friending you. friend you. How are you, my friend? I day for you, my friend. He's your friend. Your, your friend. friend. <laughs> Make you no know, me. Say you be my friend when you about travel. But friendship don't don't scatter a lot of things. So if mm. I, if you see what is going on in Bibi Nigeria now, as Bibi Nigeria housemates, mm. their friend, the friend, they knock friend up and down. <laughs> they knock them head. They up and down. Fina is crying now that uh, Bella unfollowed her. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so now na- na- the same friendship thing. Friendship matters. Yeah. So let's wrap it up. Um, signs, you know, you said when the person start forming busy. Forming yeah. busy yeah. and making it look like na need that friendship pass mm. mm. So no, you no, don't no need me. And of course, so when you actually when you actually see that this person, you know, look, you will know your friend by attitude, gestures, you know, response, and even conversations. You'll understand. Actions also speaks louder. That's for me. Your action will tell me if you're really my friend or not. And at the end of the day, I would have to make my choice. But as Mombasa did say, I'm also not the type of person that forces myself on people. I I love. Uh, I'm very powerful when I'm alone sometimes. You know, so they so say, alone, show so me your friend I and I will need, tell yeah. you who you are. I don't need to ride uh-huh. with you to be wholesome. Mm-hmm. So at the end of the day, it's a win-win for me. Mm-hmm. If, you, if you back down, fine. I'm, I'm good. Mm-hmm. Without you, I'm good. Mm-hmm. With God, you, know, you know, Debbie, fine. It's only, it was only when we were small that we, we just go to someone and beg the person, can we be friends? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Can we be friends Aww. now? <laughs> they definitely will not tell you no. You will not go and tell your parents. <laughs> they, they say, I told you, you won't tell us to be friends. They say, no, you will not be my friend. <laughs> but for now, where I don't open, I don't. You know, so then they discuss and say, can we, I can't see Mark now and say, can we be friends? <laughs> and say, when we are Ma- Ma- talking. Mark, Mark, can, can we be friends? Oh, yes, we can. Oh, uh, yes, see, yes, please. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> well, if you want to be friends with us, it's quite simple. You can follow us. Start by following us online at C4 Godwin on yes, so Twitter, Instagram. Yes, you become my friend instantly. <laughs> C4 Godwin. <laughs> yes, of course. Mark Otabo. M-A-R-K-O-T-A-B-O-R. And D-E-B-S-E-X-T-R-A. We'll be back tomorrow at 5 a.m. Hit music for Lagos. 102.3 Max FM.